Hey everyone, it is Brandon with Magic Lit Vacations, the travel planning genius. And today we have another video testimonial. We are celebrating the Foster family's first Walt Disney World vacation. And we're kind of celebrating their next Disney World vacation, which has been rescheduled due to coronavirus. So today I have the amazing Leslie and the amazing Michaela with me. Hi guys, how are you? Hello, hi. <laughs> so it's always good for families who are thinking about going to Walt Disney World to hear from other families their firsthand experience and what it was like for them. And because you guys went to Walt Disney World for the first time last year, just tell us Tell us a little bit about that, what you love, what you're excited about. Just tell us. We were so excited to go. It actually was a birthday gift for my daughter who was turning 12. And so we kind of surprised her with the trip to Disney World. And it was amazing from the day we got there to the baby left. And of course, the baby left was the saddest day ever, but it was an amazing trip. I was so excited to go. And I was just so excited to go to the different parks. It was just so fun. <laughs> yes, I love that. And do you guys have like a favorite thing that if you were to tell another family going, you said you would say you have to do this. What would that be? What would you think would be a have to do? It was just so many. Uh, my favorite thing was meeting uh, Princess Tiana. That was the one thing that I wanted to do was meet Princess Tiana. And I think Michaela, and I'm going to speak for you, she wanted to do the um, character breakfast so that she could meet Lilo and Stitch. And that was amazing. That was so much fun. It was so good. Yes, the food was great. <laughs> the food is amazing. So we just had so many good experiences. And we got a chance to luckily ride everything that we had on our list and we had a great time. And my son, who is, he was 22 at the time. He's 23 now. He's not here with us today, but he had more fun than we did. So <laughs> it was definitely a family vacation. I love, I love that so much. I know that we had, we had talked about, you know, a character dining experience you guys might enjoy in Ohana which is at the Polynesian, is the Lilo and, Lilo and Stitch character breakfast you guys are talking about. And it is so good. The food is served family style. You have amazing different Hawaiian sweetbreads and all the Mickey waffles you can eat. Yes. And of course, in addition to Lilo and Stitch, yes. you also get to meet Mickey and Pluto too. So, oh yes, that is definitely wow. a highlight. And I love that you guys were able to ride the rides you wanted to ride. What was, what was each of your favorite rides? My favorite ride was Dick Thunder Mountain and Seven Doors Mine Train. I love those. And mine would have to be Peter Pan and A Small World. I, I love that. I love that. Now remind me, you guys, are you guys roller coaster enthusiasts? <laughs> me. This one is. <laughs> this one and my son, yes. <laughs> I, I love that. But I love that. they did get me on each and every one of them. I, I rode all of the roller coasters with them, scared and all, but I did it. <laughs> <laughs> that is amazing. I love that. I love that so much. Now, in terms of, you know, vacation planning, I would love for you just to talk about what our relationship was like planning your first Disney World vacation and, and what you thought the value was of working with a travel agent. The biggest value of all is no stress on me. <laughs> I love the fact that I just tell you what I want and then you get busy. It was amazing. <laughs> it was easy, easy, easy. I, I really loved it. And that's why we're back here again. And we'll be back here again. <laughs> well, I, I appreciate that so much. You know, a lot of what I do is is sharing my Disney obsession with my clients. So it's good when you have <laughs> it's good when you have clients that are excited about the Disney vacation as much as I am. So it makes a working relationship really, really fun and easy. Now 
I would love for you guys to share, you know, there's a lot of people out there who are thinking, oh, well, I could just plan a, a vacation on my own. But especially with like coronavirus and crisis, can you share about what that experience has been like knowing that uh, that I'm taking care of you, basically. Just share with them what, that, what that's like when you actually have a travel agent in the midst of a crisis like this. Exactly, because I have been reading like horror stories on social media and all, and, and I just kind of sit back and say, oh, I just have to call Brandon or I just have to email Brandon <laughs> and he'll get it taken care of. I don't have to sit on the phone and play them customer service and can I do this or how do I change that? I just keep updating my friend Brandon and he takes care of it for us. <laughs> I love it. I love that so much. I, I, you know, that's one of the big things that we do is that you don't have to call. We take care of that for you. We've modified your reservation now. How many times have we modified it? This is what, second, third time? <laughs> I, 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 we're on second, getting ready for third, maybe. I hope not. <laughs> yeah, so we've gone through a couple iterations, but what's great about it is I'm a firm believer that everything works out for the good. So why not, would you guys like to share now that you know that you're going during um, the fall, what mm -hmm. event you're really excited about possibly experiencing? I am ready to go to the Mickey's Not So Scary Halloween Party and to see all the characters and to see like Mickey and Minnie all dressed up in their costumes and they just look different. And I'm excited to see like the castle, the show, how mm -hmm. they like project the scenes on the um, castle and the fireworks show. I, I love that. The song. only thing she didn't miss was the candy. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she's going for the characters and the fireworks mom's going for the candy mom's going for the candy she's gonna have go. a big, old, big old bag with her to go for the candy i love it so much well yeah. <laughs> well i i appreciate you guys so much sharing your experience working with me and your experience, experience with disney i can't even talk experience with disney <laughs> So if there's anything else that you want to tell a family who's maybe thinking about going to Disney World, what would you want to tell them? Or working with us, what would you want to say? Yes, and in terms of working with you guys, um, it's not a business experience. I mean, Brandon has become one of our close friends. We love hearing from Brandon. We love talking to Brandon. And it's almost like a friendship. You're just talking to one of your friends and telling them, hey, plan this vacation for me. I mean, it, it's not business and all that technical stuff at all. It's just like talking to a friend and I love it. Oh my goodness. That makes me feel so good. You know, I, I believe that when we're family, right? That's how I look at all of my clients is I'm planning a vacation yes. for my for my family. I want them to have as magical time as when I take my friends and my family to Disney. And that's why I do what I do is because I love, love hearing about the lifelong memories that you are created. Well, thank you guys so much, Michaela and Leslie. I appreciate your time so much today. You're welcome. Always a joy.